uh, the 50 years of occupation uh, is not uh, really uh, uh, for me. In my situation, it's much more. It's almost 70 years of occupation since I live in the 48 areas inside the state of Israel. Uh, the 50 years of occupation, uh, it, it means that it has been a really too much time for this to go on. Uh, it's sad to have this 50 year anniversary of occupation. It's really sad. If we lose hope, there's no meaning for our life. Uh, having hope is the reason that uh, I wake up every morning and having hope in life, uh, this is what, uh, what is motivating me for uh, being active and for keeping on my small struggle, my personal struggle and uh, to try to connect with wider struggles all over the world. Having hope is uh, is the difference, is what's making difference between uh, uh, being alive or just living. So hope is very important to me personally and I, ho and I think that it's very important in uh, the level of a nation also. When people uh, turn into hopeless, it makes uh, reality much more complicated because People uh, do positive things out of hope. When people lose hope, then things can get any better. They can only harm themselves and harm the society and harm their nation and even harm their uh, struggle. So uh, being depressed and uh, not having hope is not, uh, is not good for ending the 50 years of occupation, the opposite. We need to have this hope, no matter how much uh, reality is complicated, but it's a must.